probably enemy nexus falling at the end of the game. It's worth. If things go wrong, they always go wrong. They don't always go wrong. Mostly? I'm hoping it's like this. I think it's easier for me. Like this will be easier level one through six maybe. But this will be easier later. Oh, 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 oh. But they're queued like this, so I'd imagine they are like this too. I only have one screen, yeah. Compromise is so unsatisfying. They're low key full AD as well if Vega doesn't get ahead. Minions have spawned. Honestly, don't even know what you build on Vega now. Everfrost, I guess. When I used to play Vega, but there was glacial times with GLP and uh, shadows. But now I don't know. Electrocute probably means he wants to one-shot you with just raw AP. Maybe two even could be Ludens, but I think Everfrost is too OP. You should probably build this item right now, if you can. It's pretty busted after yes. bus. I just want to reset right now. We're getting ganked, right? Right now, I want to reset. If possible. It's kind of wave, and uh, I think in a lane like this, if I can allow my support to roam, it's good for the game, because they will never be able to do it themselves. It's kind of like yesterday's game against Rogue. With the support versus range, you can have your support roaming, but they can't really have theirs. And it's not like they're gonna dive me or something with their range support. They say I don't know when to quit. So I'm fine to lane 1v2. Weakness. Worst case I get XP, best case I get everything. I 
Did we make the cannon here? Yes, that blows. Because now I lose all the waves that I would have gotten if I didn't go for this play. Actually, my game is kind of doomed off of this sadly. I shouldn't have gone for this. I, I lose too many waves. It's gonna be really hard now. I can't deal with Hector Mook right now, I will just die. <laughs> there he comes. That was, but sure. Starting to lose waves. I guess he gets most of them with the uh, TP. Oh, I'll just take one more wave and base after. Just recall, 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 recall.
don't think they make it. Thank God, if we die there. Lucian flashed earlier. This might be a triple again for us. Legra has flashed though. Flashing off minimap, he flashed. This guy can die here. Minimap he flash, so just gonna type it out. Could be wrong. I'm more than back in the game actually. I was really out of the game and then I got triple a couple of plates. So I'm not even just in the game, I'm actually strong now. An enemy has been slain. If our existence is everyone else's chaos. I should already buy QSS though in this one, I think, maybe. I'm not sure how my champ plays against Kitch. I mean, I guess I can just stand still in the Kitch. And hit. Behind me. Got break at least. This guy might even live. Yumi has not. Okay. I mean, two for one. We got Drake double TP. Don't think it's too bad. It's not great, but it's not too bad. I'm not gonna go top. I'm gonna go mid. I think I should mute this guy. His calls are not good. Suggesting is fine, but when he's like perma pinging, it's just getting annoying. There's no plates up now. Mid has flash. It is still on flash and no TPs as well. Should hit right now. Actually, we see three, but our jungler's base it can be int. It can be really int. The enemy jungler is here. Just wait for our jungler. That a rotate mid, but I think if jungler is here, it's fine to hit this. I 
guess they weren't close enough. I went too early. And they're almost behind me as well. I should have checked this bush. Nice. Oh! <laughs> if he had the cone, he was alive. Is falling as well. I can remember here. I'm gonna have to ult here, maybe. I can't in, so I can come here maybe. Nice, I'm going mid -wave. Talking to anybody about anything is never For sure, Hecarim has no ult. I still have ult. They're on Drake, I think, as soon as it spawns, probably. They could also go around me, come here. I dive for sure, right? Or I have to flash, I guess. Okay, spot. Free drink for us. There you go, flash is right. I let him finish solo. I go mid wave. Um, I can leave now and get this in trigger. is looking good. I think mid also has no flash. I timed it earlier. 2020. To be fair, he does have CDR boots though. It's more like... This... If you don't wanna do this. Raptors might be up for it, it's funny. Thank you. Let me one shot if they flash like this, to be honest. You can also look for Lucian, but there's no flash for 40 seconds. Unless he has CDR in his runes. If he has CDR in his runes, his flash would be up right now. Been stuck in the cage, but. I have ults, I think we can kill this guy, if he ults in or something. Maybe I have to ult like this. I'm 
Lucian is alive, Vega in 5, Vega could have TP. I wouldn't survive TP here. Travel on OTP. Pushing a slash now. My pink is still out here. Oh fuck, we're dead. Actually, they fucked up. Kind of alive, but not really. I don't know where to go. <laughs> I think I have to go this way, it's the only way I can go, because Hecarim is looking for me still. I will in two seconds, so I think I survive now. If Kane lives this, we can do match. Hecarim, Nolt, Yumi, Nolt as well. I think we can do it, I have Nolt on both. Nolt, Nolt. Drava and OTP as well. I think Vega has TP though, and Lucian might as well. This could be bad. But we can't tank it forever with Sion. So we could do it like this as two, and then they just play with them. It's free. I grab Nolt, no flash, so I can't really get him. Uh, not sure if Sion should do this though. It's fine if he hits it, yeah. I'm not gonna reset. 400 for IE. Could look here. I get stunned? Oh. I can maybe kill him here. Close. Healing was a lot. Yumi can't win. I guess they all die. Drama flash. Vega flash. Nice. Penta. Hagram is up. Penta. Soul as well for us. There. It's also boots. Thanks for ruining it. Wait, did Lucian flash on me as well? He did not. Your team has destroyed a turret. Do you remember our escape route? I can last it, I think. The red is up. Oh, dangerous, dangerous. Our red is up as well. I'm pretty sure Lucian flashed on me earlier when I died, but I'm not gonna... Ooh, I like this. I wanna join in on this. Banger. That's a banger right there. Uh, I like to pick up red and stuff. Still have my pink out on both sides here. Don't wanna remove that. I think it's good to the pink to have.
In my head, Lucian has no flush, same time as top and AD. Actually, 30 less, because you have boots. Still winning. I'm so bad. That should be root every time. I will. Wow, I got something there. My bad. Tool to Vega Cage. Probably shouldn't even flash in in the first place because even if I get that kill, it won't mean anything. We had like two members dead after uh, Relian Sol was gone, so that kill is worth nothing. Better to say flash. I really don't want to buy QSS just for Vega, but I think I have to. I think there's actually quite a big chance we lose this game. I mean, we have soul and stuff, but you mean scaling, and they something. I feel like at some point Aurelian won't be able to do. I mean, he could do the big stars, I guess. But if it's like straight up five v five, there's a chance we lose. I think without the big star. Yeah, I'll kill this guy top maybe. It's Nash if I kill this guy top, probably. Ken is dying right now though. Nature is wild and untamed, not balanced. Taking the cone into pit red. Pretty fast boy. Let's go stuff. Not sure, I think. Drummond is up too. Flashes are up as well. Oh, we do it, we do it for sure. Zion doesn't take damage. This might be a problem though. Maybe not. Yeah, we can leave right now. Don't recall there though, I think. Okay. No one will block my path. I'm pretty OP now. Do you think I need what do I need actually? Maybe I just do BT. I think the theory that I talked about yesterday, where at some point in the game, killing like Hecarim and Jarman doesn't do anything, I think this is kind of applying here. Like the people I have to kill is Lucian and Vagar. So I should itemize for this. Even though it's fucking nice to build like Dominic's against uh, Hecarim and Jarman. Killing them doesn't change the game that much. Uh, I'm not really feeling tank here. I mean, if you EQs with Jarvan, maybe. Otherwise, I go here, I think. He might be dying right now. He might be dying right now.
He has no mana, so he can't kill him. I think. Oh, he got Ember Frost. <laughs> Elder, probably, right? The Elder here, probably. 3 2. So, how do we itemize to kill their squishies? I think we build a BT. I think that's the play. So, for those who weren't here yesterday, basically, what happened was I built Lord Dominix, and every fight I killed enemy frontline, and got like crazy amount of kills but I couldn't kill enemy backline because I had to my kill enemy frontline and then we lost anyways because Rice was really OP so I came to the conclusion that even though it's nice to build tank killing item when the game is like this and their tanks are relevant anyways it's better to itemize before killing squishy because I will have to kill their squishies to uh, end the game that's just how it is Nice alert. Wait, 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 don't end, don't end. Don't end, don't end, don't end. Don't end. I wanna kill this guy. <laughs> Someone kill the Yumi. <laughs> nice. <laughs> you can end now, you can end, you can end. You can end. I mean, I'm down to take another kill, you know. I have Elder here, so if I hit anything, they die. I can hit this Q and E, he dies, I think. Should die to Elder. Yeah, nice Elder. I think quick plays is good if I can perma hit, but I wouldn't be able to perma hit in this one. BT is better to get the shield than just some life still going. Because for some reason, 